Hello everyone, so here's how we arrange this week's bunch called Fields of Gold. But first of all, it's incredibly important to look after your flowers. So to do that, first of all, I'm going to snip an inch off the end of all my stems using clean, sharp secateurs. Secateurs are best for this to get through the sunflowers. Then I'm going to fill my vase about a third full with some lovely clean room temperature water. And then I'm going to pop in my flower food. So to arrange, I'm going to start with my shorter flowers around the edge, building to my taller flowers in the middle. And my shorter flowers are going to be my sunflowers first, which I'm going to arrange in an even triangle. And then I'm going to do exactly the same with my Alstroemeria filling the gaps. And what I've created here is our structural stem grid in the middle of the vase, which is going to allow our taller flowers to stand upright in. So next, I'm going to pop in my lovely Menorca lilies. That's their name. And they're going to stand upright in the centre using the other stems for support. And now I want to add to the structure using my lovely eucalyptus foliage tucked over the edge, creating a sort of foliagey nest. My Crocosmia is now going to stand up very easily on either side of the two lilies using the lovely structure for support. And now I can create an even triangle with my even taller gladioli in and around the lilies and Crocosmia. If you've got any lower flower heads on the gladioli below the neck of the vase line, do whip them off and that will also encourage the top ones to open. And now, finally, to finish off, a bit of lovely dried wheat, which you can simply pop throughout. So there we have it, an arrangement absolutely perfect for September, and in a few days it will go from looking a bit like this... to something a little more like this.